Massive wildfires are blazing in northern and southern California, ravaging both ends of the state. Governor Gavin Newsom declared a statewide emergency as historic winds made it difficult to contain the flames. I'm cautious when I say this, but near historic wind event at a scale and scope, the likes of which we haven't seen in some time. Uh, that precipitated today with a new statewide emergency declaration because 43 counties now are impacted by red flag warnings uh, and by these severe uh, weather conditions. Here's a look at where the fires are, the damage they have caused, and where they could spread. The Kincaid fire began October 23rd in Geyserville, Sonoma County, and prompted evacuation orders for close to 200,000 residents. The blaze has burned more than 66,200 acres, which is roughly the size of Sacramento. It has caused extensive damage to wineries and residential areas. As of October 27th, the fires in wine country were reportedly only 5% contained. In Southern California, the Tick Fire began to spread on October 24th in Santa Clarita. Officials said the area just north of Los Angeles has burned more than 4,300 acres, igniting several homes. While firefighters have contained some of the tick fire, a second, fast-moving brush fire erupted in Los Angeles in the early hours of October 28th. The Getty Fire, named after the Getty Museum near the blaze, covered 400 acres in two and a half hours. This prompted the evacuation of more than 10,000 buildings. This area, near the Pacific Ocean and State Park land, includes the homes of several celebrities, like LeBron James. The California wildfires are nowhere close to being over. Both sets of fires have been fed by strong winds, which continue to prevent firefighters from fully beating back the flames. The Kincaid Fire is marching southwest towards Santa Rosa, where a blaze in 2017 incinerated more than 5,000 properties. And in Los Angeles, strong dry winds are sloping downward, causing what the National Weather Service calls, quote, extremely critical fire weather conditions. Winds could gust as high as 70 miles per hour in higher elevations and mountain passes from Santa Barbara to San Diego. The LA Fire Department said the, quote, very dynamic blaze is moving west into forest land. The ongoing wildfires come on the heels of the devastating 2017 and 2018 California fire seasons, which featured the largest, most destructive, and deadliest blazes in state history. The Camp Fire killed 85 people and destroyed swaths of the state in 2018, including the town of Paradise.